Good morning. You know, I, yesterday I was at uh, this softball field, which is another place I stay a lot. And while I was there, I called Pastor Tom, and I was asking him what he was doing for a sermon, and so I was going to do something to go along with it. But then I changed my mind last night at 9 o'clock, because, yeah, for a number of reasons, but one, because today's Father's Day. And I just thought I wanted to talk about dads and maybe let you share a couple of things about yours. Now, you know, in the Bible, there is this neat verse, and it goes like this. And you know, this is God talking to us. Listen, my sons and daughters, to a father's instruction. Pay attention and give understanding. So God is saying to us that all of us need to listen to our fathers, and certainly our mothers too and that they will teach us the right way to go. Just from that, just that short little phrase. Now, I know God, uh, God gave us very wise fathers. I know I had a very wise one. And I want you to tell me today if you can think of anything your dad has ever said to you that you thought was very wise. Wise means smart. I, I think this is going to be fun. <laughs> you know, maybe you were doing something wrong. Okay, don't forget it because I really want to hear it. You, okay, keep thinking, Grace. You think that your brother's a knucklehead? He said that. No. <laughs> anything to keep you out of trouble or keep you from getting hurt? No special wisdoms? Wisdom meaning things you can do so you don't get in trouble? Well, then I've got some things here that some wise fathers said. I'm not going to read them all, but these are wise things that fathers have said to their children sometimes. I'll keep you waiting. I'll keep you waiting. Don't you know what means. Okay, wise means a smart thing dad's told you. Something that makes your life better, safer. Oh, he, he helps me go to bed. He helps you. He might say it's time to go to bed. Get your pajamas on. How many times do you say that? <laughs> oh, 1900. Okay. Yeah, he said All right, well, let's go on to the wise things I have listed here. Ready, guys? Okay, you're talking to your dad and you've asked him something and I think he's probably said no and you're arguing. And yeah. he says, why did I tell you how to go to bed now? Because I said so, that's why. Is that a wisdom? You better believe it because I said so. It doesn't have to be any other reason, right? Okay, here's another one. And I, my dad never said this to me, but I bet a lot of people have said it. Just wait till you have kids of your own. You'll find out. <laughs> okay? And I'm going to skip some of them, but I like this one. Now, my dad never said this to me, but my husband says, Do I look like I'm made out of money? <laughs> Watching the game. Ever heard Dad say that wisdom? Yeah. 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 I love this one. When you break your leg doing that, don't come running to me. Okay. This is another one. Daddy never said this to me, but my husband did. No, we're not lost. Understand. Okay, and fi finally, I like this one. Be quiet. Can't you see? I'm trying to think. You gotta be quiet to think. And the number one top saying of a wise father. Ready for the number one one? Okay, it says, How should I know? Go ask your mother. <laughs> Too. You can always go back and forth to them both. 
you know, it says that as your mother. And your father. And your mother. And your father. And your father. And your father. I used to do that, but I'm going to tell you another wisdom. They are wise to that all the time. <laughs> so don't try it. They probably try it. Oh, okay. yeah. Now, all of these just remind me of what wonderful dads are. Because these are funny things they say, but they say all of them because they love you because they want you to be safe. They don't want any harm to come to you. And all of you sitting here today are so blessed because your dads and moms have brought you to church. And there are so many children in this world that never had a mother or dad to do that. And so we not only feel blessed to have dads, but moms as well. And so right from the Bible it says all of our instruction is going to come from our fathers and mothers. Okay? Let's bow our heads. Dear God, we thank you so very much for you, our Heavenly Father, and we thank you for blessing each of us with our most wonderful fathers. Amen.